Okay, welcome back to Algo.js. Today's question is going to be leak code 21, merge two sorted lists. So you're given the heads of two sorted linked lists, list one and list two, merge the two lists in one sorted list. The list should be made by splicing together the node, the first two lists, return the head of the merge linked list. So we can't create a copy of these lists. We have to merge the two together. So in the first example, we have list one and list two as the input arrays and we have merged them together in ascending order. Okay, so for this question, we are going to be merging the two together and we need to keep the original kind of nodes within this new list that we're creating. So in order to create a new list, we need to initialize a dummy value. So this dummy, it doesn't matter what value it is. It could be any arbitrary value. So we've initialized dummy. We're gonna set head to equal dummy. Now this is important because at the end we're going to be returning head we're going to be using this as a reference so now we can start the loop so we need to loop through both of these so we need to loop through and compare both of these values so let's start off by comparing one and one they're both the same so it doesn't really matter which one we choose remember this is l1 this is l2 let's just say we choose l1 so we set the next node of dummy to equal l1 which is one and then we update l1 to l1.next so we move that one over here we've covered this so we don't need to look at that section anymore. We repeat the process. So one is smaller than two. So we use L2's current value, which is one. And we set L2 to its next value. So we can remove this from the search criteria. Now we compare two and three. So we update L1 to here. Remember we're updating dummy to dummy.next down here. We compare three and three. Let's say we take L1 again. So we have three here. We've checked this. So we can remove it from the search criteria. Now L1 is pointing to null. So we've reached the end of one of the lists. So there are no more comparisons between the two. So there is one more operation we need to carry out. And that is we need to add the end of L2 or what's left in L2 to the end of dummy. Okay, so we created H or we created head as a reference. So all we need to do now is return head.next. So now we can move on to time and space complexity time complexity for this algorithm is O n plus m where n is the length of L1 and m is the length of n2 and space complexity is O of 1. So let's start this off by creating that dummy node so we can initialize it to any arbitrary value. Let's create head which we're going to use as a reference and set it to dummy. Now we can create the while loop while list one does not equal null and list two does not equal null, we can check if list one, if its value is less than or equal to list two. If it is, then we set dummy.next to equal list one and then update list one to its next value. Else we can do the same but for list two. Remember to update dummy to its next value so we can add on to the tail of dummy. Now outside this while loop, one of the list is going to be equal to null. So all we need to do is append to dummy the rest of the list that is not equal to null. So if list one does not equal null, dummy.next is equal to list one. Else we'll set dummy.next to list two. And then we can return head.next because we used head as that reference at the start. Let's run it. Okay, let's submit it. And there you have it. 